Welcome to our What's New in 2020 series. I'm David, and I'll take you to the updates for Flexible Components. The Tilter Jet represents the latest in OMAX innovation. By positioning the nozzle at calculated angles, the taper from the abrasive water jet is offset. This means that parts are cut with square edges and cutting time can be reduced. Like OMAX, SOLIDWORKS continues to innovate with flexible components so you can improve your design to manufacture processes. Subassemblies are used to represent the multiple mechanisms and linkages in the tilter jet. These assemblies are made flexible so that the mechanical motion can be evaluated at the top level. To finish this design and protect the moving parts from the abrasive material, O-rings and bellows are put in place. But how do you make them flexible so they properly connect to the rest of the assembly? With SOLIDWORKS 2020, this task is dramatically simplified. Use the new Make Part Flexible tool to remap the external references of the part with ease. In this case, the 3D path of the bellows will reference the cylindrical face of the pivot ball housing. After clicking OK, the geometry updates and continues to update automatically after each assembly movement. This process is repeated for the other instance of the bellows part without creating unique configurations or separate part files. This optimizes your data management and efficiency, bringing parts to life. Whether it be living hinges, bellows, springs, cables and beyond, use Make Part Flexible with SOLIDWORKS 2020 to improve how you visualize and validate your next assembly. In summary, flexible components can now remap external references, use multiple instances with BOM support, control mass properties and support custom properties, enabling optimized data management, improved efficiency, and increased visualization and validation. Mm -hmm.